Hello and welcome back to my pack me video. Um, you saw one of these pack me videos. I might dim light and see if that makes any difference to the light. Mm, a bit dark, so maybe not. But basically, a few weeks ago, I did a pack me video for Greece where we went on a beach summer holiday for two weeks, 16 days in total, including travelling. And today I'm going to do the same, but for my next holiday. My next holiday is in Amsterdam for six full days. Um, yeah, so we literally get there tomorrow at lunchtime. Six full days, so I need to pack. Now, you may be thinking the suitcase looks slightly different to last time. Basically, my suitcase actually got wrecked on the way there. Basically, I it wasn't the best, it was quite an old suitcase anyway, and it was a bit worn and torn and stuff like that. But the wheel came off, one of the wheels came off, the, I have two wheels in my suitcase and one came off and the handle, this bit up here, a uh, handly bit at the top, at uh, this handle, not, well actually, I didn't, didn't have one of them, like the long handle plus this handle, got both got completely wrecked and basically there was not there was basically no chance of me bringing my stuff home unless I bought a new suitcase. So we, went to, we knew we were going to Rose Town for the day anyway where there's normal shops. So like when we go then, we have to buy a suitcase otherwise I can't bring my stuff home. And we thought we may as well look and buy a decent suitcase that could be my actual suitcase, not just a cheap one to bring my stuff home with. So we got this one, I'm not going to say how much it was, but I got this suitcase and it's a really nice suitcase and it's now my official suitcase. We went for the option of buying a decent one and keeping it rather than a cheap one. Just for one use and it's got my name tag on and everything. And it's rose gold, you can't quite see. It's rose it's a hunter suitcase, rose gold and silver. I much prefer it to my other one anyway. But obviously if the other one didn't break, I would still be using it. Because even I don't do this thing where if I've gone off it, I change. I just use it to you you worn and then I change it. So I am gonna be packing right now for if I was going to Amsterdam. Um and obviously I'll have to take the fact that I need like my toothbrush, my wash bag and maybe a pair of shoes that I'm gonna travel in tomorrow. But I'm mainly gonna just be showing you what I'm packing. So we're going to Amsterdam for six days in an apartment. We're going to a concert whilst we're there. So I may need an extra outfit for a concert, but I may just... I'm going to be taking spare stuff anyway, just in case. The weather is supposed to be around 25 degrees, which obviously, in roads, it's like 35 and you're passing out and you're in shorts or you're in a bikini all day. Whereas this one's a city holiday. We are, There is a beach, so we are taking swimwear just in case. But it may be too cold to go in the sea. And we're not taking beach towels because it'll literally only be for like a day or an afternoon. And beach towels are quite heavy. So it's six days and I'm just going to show you exactly what I'm packing. I need six day outfits, plus a few spares, a pair of shorts just in case, a couple of evening outfits, concert outfit. And yeah, that's basically, and a couple of jumpers and raincoats. Whereas Greece, I needed beach stuff, swimwear, loads of evening outfits, loads of different... This is the thing, I need a lot less. Even if it's only half the length, I need a lot less than half the clothes. Because I took loads of shoes, I took flip flops, sandals, running shoes, pumps, all sorts of shoes and this time I'm taking pumps and running shoes and obviously I'll be wearing a pair but I'm just going to pack them all and then take whatever out I need tomorrow and tomorrow we are leaving, well, I'm getting up at 5.30 and we're leaving at 6.30 to be at Leeds airport for 8 that's our closest airport, it only takes an hour to get to but in case there's traffic or a road blockage or something we are taking an hour and a half to get into an hour uh, when we went to Greece, and it shouldn't take as long to get to security as well because it's only Leeds. That's our closest airport. And obviously, when we went to Greece, we went to Manchester, and we we got a lot busier. It took like an hour to get to security. So I'm just going to crack on. I'm explaining what we're doing. And if you don't know, we're off to an Ariana Grande concert. Also, the mode of transport, quite a lot of people cycle around there, so cycling is a big thing to do. And there's a park, so there is going to be a helmet featured in this, so I can cycle. And there is a park, so we'll be running. I think the plan on playing crazy golf as well. That was spoken about. So yeah, there's lots of stuff happening, so let's get on with packing. 
So the first thing I'm going to do is put my shoes in. I'm going to pack all my shoes. I'm going for a run after this. I need to take my running shoes back out again. Um, so the first thing I'm going to... Oh yeah, ignore my hair. One thing I'm going to say, ignore my hair. So if you saw yesterday's vlog, I went to a hair salon for the first time. And I got my hair Dutch braided for the first time. I usually have it in French plaits or ponytail. But I got it Dutch plaited for the first time. And I like it so much I don't want to take it out. And it is a little bit of a mess, so just ignore that. So I don't know which side. I might put shoes and helmets in this side. And then the zip side put on my clothes. So I've got my running shoes. So obviously they're going to go in. I'm obviously going to have to undo this stuff and take some stuff. I think everything's out of the wash that I need. Because obviously we've only just got back a week ago. We got back last Thursday. Everything's been washed and put away. So everything I need should be in my wardrobe. And I know what I'm packing. So the next thing I've got are some pumps. I have two pairs. I need to decide. What it, so I need to these pumps. They've got gross stuff underneath. And then these pumps. They're both pretty warm. And I do have some bright, I don't know if you can actually see. I've got some bright pink pumps as well, but they're not been worn, they're brand new. I don't want to ruin them. So the weather's only 25 degrees, I need to think about that. Whereas, so I need trousers. Although, I need to pack more trousers than jumpers. That's instead of beach stuff with flip flop, instead of beach towel flip flops, those when wear, I'll be needing jumpers and coats, but not many. And then my shoes, I might stand at the front so you can actually see what I'm packing. So now we're going to go on to pyjamas and nightwear. And there is some stuff on the floor still, but I'm thinking it may be cold, but I don't change pyjamas, like, I probably wear two pairs a week, and we're only going for a week, so I only need two pairs of pyjamas. So the first pair of pyjamas, I've just kicked my helmet because it's on the floor, is my Hollister pyjamas. I don't want to have to, I don't really need to fold stuff because there's, we have 23 kilograms worth of luggage for six days. I'm not going to need anywhere near as much as 23. Um, and my suitcase fits 23 as well, so whereas my other one that broke only fit is 17. So it is a bigger suitcase as well. So I'm not going to need 23, so I don't necessarily need to, fo obviously I need to fold it like fold it. But I don't need to like roll it tight or anything because I still have room to put everything in. So all my all my clothes are going to go in the zip side. So that's like one pair of pajamas. I may take a short pair of pajamas. So I've got. I've also got. Give me a sec. I've got these pajama shorts or pajama trousers, which I'm going to pack. But I'm currently wearing these in bed at the moment and I've worn them for two nights. So these aren't going to go in, they're just going to go back to the side and I'll put them in in the morning. Actually no, I'll just put them in and then I can take them back out again. And this is a normal t-shirt, but I actually wear it as a bed t-shirt. Just because I don't, I have loads more pyjama bottoms compared to tops. Like I have way more pyjama bottoms than tops, so... This is a normal t-shirt I wear, that's now officially a pyjama t-shirt because it's like light wear so you don't get hot in bed. Um, other pyjamas, I'm going to take some short pyjamas just, just in case. Actually no, I might just take... Now I've got these pyjamas, these long pyjamas. Realistically I only need two pairs. But just take three just in case. So I've got them pajamas, and then I've got the matching top to go with them here. And then if it is hot, I'll wear that t-shirt with a, a pair of short pajamas. But it just all depends. So that is nightwear done. So the outfit I'm wearing currently are. Just a plain t-shirt which isn't going. This jumper is going. So it'll be packed after. And then these running trousers, these are my running leggings. So these will also be going in. But obviously I can't put them in now because I'm wearing them. Next we're going to go with... Now... 
I'm going to go with shorts, trousers, stuff like this, basically. And I've got, a, I might, I might take a belt just in case, just in case for any trousers or dress. I did wear this in Greece, so just in case, you never know what, you never know. So I'll take a belt. And then as you know, I have two favourite shorts in, um, in, um, Greece. And this is my denim, one of the shorts. If it's warm enough, these will be warm, probably the most. And obviously I've got a denim, like a, I don't know what you call these, but like jogging bottom material. Take them just in case, so like that, like if we end up with the beach and it's warm. Um, and then I've got jogging bottom sit around the apartment in, because we're in an apartment. And I will show you my room in the apartment when we go. That's just in, that's just so around the apartment when we're chilling or stuff like that. Then obviously I need, if it's not warm enough, I need trousers to wear during the day. So. I have got two pairs of jeans. They are pretty much the same pair of jeans. They're not identical, but they're similar. I just dropped them. So I've got these jeans here and then i've got these jeans here they're pretty much the same but they're not the same um i'm going to put take leave a pair out so i can wear them tomorrow traveling and the other pair will go in the actual suitcase um and that's like trousers section done and my suitcase is nowhere near full. So I think now I might put my raincoat in. I have to take this to grief because it's raining in Manchester. I was going to leave it in the car but it was raining and I wanted to wear it into the... Because we were getting a bus to the airport last time. It was raining so I was just like... From the car park to the... Um, airport. It was raining in Manchester so I had to take this. And obviously they need actually in Greece, Amsterdam, mini Doranko. But obviously it's raining in the morning, I'll have to take it back out again. Um, and I should probably put my helmet in, seeing as it's pretty big. And it's going to take up a lot of room in my suitcase. jumpers now I think three jumpers are efficient for this trip three I don't know maybe three I think three jumpers is maybe efficient so I've got a choice of jumpers I've got a choice now I've got a mixture of jumpers to pick from this one I'm wearing is one of them this one here is gonna be one and then in case it's hot, this is like a light one. So I'll take this light one. And this is the one I took to Greece just in case of a chilly night or whatever. That's what I took to Greece. Um, this one I'm taking because it's practical and I literally wear it because it's like a nice oversized one. And it's good for a plane when the plane's cold. This is like a good plane jumper, so I may travel in that. But we'll decide later if... I travel in that. This one I like. So this one is coming too. And then I've got this one here which isn't going to come because I think I packed three and I was wearing one. So I think that's efficient. Um, yeah, that's efficient. So I've got grey jumper, pink and white jumper and a blue jumper. I do want to take this one as well. We're only going for six days and four jumpers, three in my suitcase, one I'm wearing, four should be enough, so I'm not sticking this grey one. Because whatever matches the grey one, will not match the blue one probably. Uh, actually no, I might take this. I just can't decide, I don't need a new jumper every single day though. I'm 
I might just pack it as well. I might take this one out actually. Because what's actually going to matter? Oh, I don't know. Now I'll leave it in and then decide later which ones I take out. So now we're on to like t shirt section and what like t shirts I need to wear. So, t shirts I need six for like six days. And I'm thinking an evening one, a couple for like evening, forget chain. Maybe a spare one in case I spill something on a t-shirt. I have to get changed half through the day. I'm just gonna take about eight or nine. Just a couple of spare ones. So I'm gonna quickly go. I I have decided which t-shirts I'm taking. I'm gonna take. If you want to know, my sun hat is also in here because I've got like a sun. So sun hat section can, a oh yeah, running top doesn't count as one of my t-shirts, that's just like an extra. So, mm, there's too many t-shirts to decide from. So I've got, I'm going to count the t-shirts I've just, oh yeah, I need a hat. Where's my, this is my hat. Come my, actually, my Converse one could do with the wash and I haven't put it in the wash. So I'm going to take this one, my New York Yankee hat. Now I'm going to the non-clothes side. I do have to take away a jumper, but I don't know which one. So, and I'm taking one I'm wearing as well. So I can't take five jumpers. Basically, like one a day, pretty much. I, and I'm going to quickly put in my Jack Will wash bag as well. Um, so t-shirt wise there's quite a lot here but I'm going to count them and then discard some if need be there are about this is not even half my t-shirt well no it's not probably half not far off half I don't think well anyway these are my t-shirts so this one here is this one I've decided this grey one is coming out because I don't need it and um, well I might take the blue one out I might take I'm still deciding over these jumpers because I don't need many of the pack I might leave the blue one out but then if it's warm but not like boiling I need a thin one <sighs> this is dilemmas 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 with and what to pack and what not to pack So I'm going to leave, take the grey one out. That's my decision because that's enough. So I can wear each of them twice. Eat, wear each jumper twice. So that's enough jumpers now. Pack three. So there's my first t-shirt going in. Oh yeah, I haven't decided which t-shirt I'm travelling in yet. So that will obviously be a factor. So I've got this pink one here. I have got, this is my newest one, I got it like three, four days before my last four grease. I've still got bags of room, this, the right side with the shoes and the helmet is literally not even, probably only half full. I feel like the clothes side might be full but like, and then we've got this one here. So I'm counting my t-shirts, I'm going to get eight. Six for six days plus two spare, that's eight. So one, two, three, and this is t shirt number four. And then this is t shirt number five. And then t shirt number six, I'm not taking that one. T shirt number six is my running top. I'm running trousers are on me, so I can't pack them. But my running top, I needed to pack this. In case it's hot, it's going to be hotter there than here. So, and this is like thinner material, so I might as well wear a normal t shirt to run in today and pack my number one. So I've got a running top plus one, two, 
three, four normal t-shirts. This is number five. This is t-shirt number five. I'm literally unfolding them to show you and then folding them back up to put back in. That's five. Plus a running t-shirt. I'm just going to count. This is six. Uh, this is seven, so I need to find one more t-shirt. So that is t-shirt number seven. Um, I need to get rid of this one because I'm not taking that one. Uh, I need to find... Oh, I found... I could... So these are the options that I've got to choose from for t-shirts for my final t-shirt. I don't need all of them. Actually, I might take a soon. So I've got... I don't know what I'm wearing for Ariana Grande concert. I'll just pick a t-shirt with a pair of trousers. Or a pair of shorts. I'm going to take that one. And then it's between... I might take this as well. I don't know if my arm's in the way. Or... It's between this one, but I need one to travel in as well, so. So I've got eight t-shirts in, I've got eight plus running t-shirt in there, so that'll be enough. I might not pack either of these, actually. I've got eight plus a running t-shirt already. But then, but then, what have you got changed in the I don't feel like I need two a day, but I feel like I need more than two spare. And I'll leave it at that for now. Um, so then, what else needs to go in here? So, underwear and underwear I'll have to do after. And then I've got socks I need to put in. So socks are something... So obviously I need socks every single day, plus a couple of spare socks, plus bunion socks. So let's get on the socks section. So... I need to keep... Some socks. These this might look like a lot, but I'm gonna just sort them out. So I don't know how many times we're running. So I'm gonna pack three. Um, so I can put that pair away. Um, so that's socks number one. Socks number two. Socks number three. Socks number four, socks number five, socks number six, socks number seven, socks number eight, socks number nine. And then my sock, I'm going to take a bikini just in case if I'm going to go on the beach. So that's the next. Now you saw all three when I went to Greece. Which one's the best one? I say. I may not even wear. It. I might take the multicolored one. I may not even need it, but I'll take the multicolored one. So I'll take the multicolored one. I'm not really need to fold it because I still wear the rib. I'll just shove it down like the side. This section's getting pretty full now, but I need to put even in a tire in in case I need even outfits. I don't really need. I don't know if I need to wear tights with my dresses. Now this is where. Now I took, if I showed you previously, so this, these two go together, so this cardigan with this dress, now this dress, this cardigan, I didn't wear this cardigan but I did take it to Greece, this time it will be needed, so these would be, these are going to be taken. So that's like one evening outfit and I'm just going to wear it with a pair of pumps. I'm not taking these in shoes like sandals or whatever. It was just going to be with my pink, I think the pink pumps, I wear it with the pink pumps. I'm going to have to take a pair of pumps out to actually, well, just travel in. So that side's going to be pretty empty. But this side's going to be full, so. It's not going to be a lot lighter than the other one. 
So also I need another outfit. I don't know how many times we're going out, but I can always wear one twice. So I'm gonna pack. I think this one's appropriate. Let me just get it off the hanger. It's actually caught onto another dress. Give me a sec. This one. Because I can wear it with pumps. And I can also wear the day thing as well. If I don't want to wear trousers. If it's warm to wear shorts, I can wear this instead. Got like nice pockets in and I can wear the belt. I wear a belt when I wear the wear that pink belt when I wear that. So that can be another evening attire. Or a day dress if it or I can wear it during the day if it's hot enough. Um what else do I need? I might take um, I don't know. I feel like I should take one of my butterfly dresses. I'm thinking of blue one. Just in case and I can wear it in my pink pumps. And that's like an even. But I feel like I might actually take the grey one, not the blue one. So then I have because I've already got a blue butterfly dress, so I'll take the grey one instead of the blue one. And that might be enough. That'll be enough outfits. It's like three evening outfits. And I can always wear them twice if need be. I may not even need one every single day anyway, so. So that is basically everything I need for my holiday. And I've still got that side empty, so I've not done bad going. That is me fully packed for my holiday. All I've got to do now is I'm also going to take a pair of shoes out. Um, I'm going to have to uh, take my wash bag out to use it tonight and in the morning. Put in my running trousers. And that is literally all I've got. Oh yeah, my laptop's going to go in as well. My laptop is going in as well to, um, yeah, to watch films and stuff on. Oh. Actually, in this side might be too full. This side may be too full. I feel like I've forgotten something. So this side's had too full. This side's had too full. It did shut, but yeah. So I need for my laptop in. I don't know if I need it. I don't decide if I need it. I probably do if I'm uploading videos and stuff. So let's get the charger out of here. I know my laptop is dead at the moment. And the flight is only literally an hour. It's literally... Um, oh, it's all knotted up. The flight's only literally an hour, so... I don't need it on the flight. Last time I took it on the flight. So that can go in there and my laptop can sit on top. And yeah. But I feel like it's maybe broken in my lap. I feel like if I take my laptop it'll get broken in the suitcase. So I might bury it within my clothes. But I'll do that later. So I'm just going to zip this up. Basically the bulk of my packing done. So let me shut this. That side actually when I moved it was quite heavy. Because I packed all my other three jumpers, I might just wear this one to travel in. Instead of deciding which one out of the four to travel in. Because obviously it wasn't in my suitcase. Let me just I'm not the greatest when it comes to shutting suitcases. Now I need to stop it there, that zip, because of the lock. There's like a lock on it and you have to put the um, zips into the lock. I don't know if you can see very well, there's like a lock bit there. You have the wrong code, I was check the code. And then you just put, it's not going to work now because it's not open. But you like just open it and you put them down in there when that bit's open. Yeah, I'll, I'll open it and do that because obviously I've changed the right code and stuff. So yeah, I do hope you enjoyed this pack for me video. Let me just put my 
plastic is down there. I do hope you enjoy my pack me video. If you do, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe down below. Um, and, and I guess enjoy the rest of the holiday. More holiday vlogs are coming your way. So if it's another holiday, another trip. And let's vlog it. Thank you very much for watching and I will see you very, very soon with another video.